everyone. Thank you for tuning in. Today's recipe, I will show you how to make the traditional Edo black soup. I am Rosie. Welcome to my kitchen. I will be using goat meat. You can use any meat of your choice. To begin, I will season the meat with blended peppers and onions. Season powder, salt. I'll go over it with my hands and mix everything together. I'll cover and allow the meat to marinate for at least one hour before preparing it. Next, I'll head over to the garden to pluck some fresh bitter leaves. We have two types of Edo black soup. We have the one that is prepared with combination of different leaves. And we have the one that is prepared with just bitter leaf. So today, I will be making the one with just bitter leaves. So I'll add salt to the bitter leaf and then wash it. I'll be rubbing it with my hand like so, as if you're washing clothes and all the foam is going to come out and the bitterness as well. Bitter leaves is very healthy and very medicinal. It has lot of health benefits. So I'm going to be washing it like so until all the foam starts to come out and then I'll keep recycling it until it is no longer too bitter so i will pour it through the strainer to get rid of that set of water and i will repeat the process until the bitter leaf is well washed you can wash it to your desired texture if you like it very bitter you don't have to wash it too much some people also boil it to take out the bitterness i just wash it until it gets to my right consistency and I will strain it out so after washing the bitter leaves for about seven times is okay for me next ingredients I'll be using dried fish stock fish beef tripes green peppers which i got from the garden you can use any type of peppers you like onions you can use more or less onions crayfish dry shrimps asioto locust beans season cube salt palm nut cream i don't have the fresh one where i live if you have the fresh one you can use it you can also use red palm oil as well and if you don't like oil you can also cook your black soup without adding oil and it will come out so good i will be using two cooking spoons of the palm nut cream you can use more you can use less i will add some hot water to dissolve it I will stir and once it's well dissolved, I'm going to leave it to settle down a bit before using it. The goat meat is well marinated. I will take off the cover and transfer it to a baking tray. I will be baking the meat in the oven until it is well dried. I like to make black soup with either dried meat or bush meat, but you can cook it before using it so the stock fish i will add salt hot water allow it to soak a bit and wash it next i will add the peppers which are nicely clean to the bitter leaves onions 
Asioto, which is also known as Oriema seed. Crayfish. And I'll transfer everything to a blender and blend it. I will blend until I get a smooth paste. Back home then, we use grinding stone to grind the leaves until it is very smooth. The goat meat is out of the oven and is well dried. It's time to make the soup. In a pot, I will gently pour the palm nut cream. And you know to do this very carefully so you don't get the sediment back inside the pot. I'll add the stock fish, the beef tripes, which is pre cooked already, the dried goat meats, seasoned cube, salt. I'll add some water, give it a quick stir. Cover and cook until they are tender. The soup base is be cooking now for about 30 minutes. I will check if everything is ready. And at this point, everything is ready. Next, I will add the blended bitter leaves. I'll rinse the bowl with water and add that locust beans dry shrimps blended crayfish and stir so for black soup you can make it either thick or light it's totally up to you and this is the consistency i like I will test for seasoning and adjust it if needed. I'll cover and leave it to cook for about 10 to 15 minutes. It's been 15 minutes. I will take off the cover. Oh my goodness. I wish you can perceive the delicious aroma going on in my kitchen. I will then add in the dried fish and then stir everything together. The Edo black soup, which we also call omebe, is very delicious and super healthy as well. As an adult girl, this is the first soup I learned how to prepare. And this is my best soup. You can enjoy it with any type of swallow of your choice. And you can also drink it as well. And the soup is ready. I will be making cassava fufu to enjoy the Edo black soup. So in an empty pot, I added fermented cassava and room temperature water. I will stir it until it is dissolved. Once it's well dissolved, I will transfer it to the stove top to cook. Keep stirring it until it comes together. You can enjoy the Edo black soup with any swallow of your choice, but having it with cassava fufu for me takes me back to my childhood. Once it comes together, I will take out the spatula. Add some water to it and break it. So if you like it very soft, you have to add more water. Make it to your own consistency. I'll cover and leave it to cook for about 10 minutes. It's been 10 minutes. I'll take off the cover and then stir it together until it comes together and the cassava fufu is ready. And I will wrap it and serve. Thank you all so much for watching. Remain blessed. I will see you in my next video.